Hey there folks, uh, I'm just making some provies and mac and cheese for dinner. Um, mac and cheese is for my four-year-old chefs that she insisted on having tonight. Um, one thing I just wanted to show you, I'm using our non-stick uh, pots and pans that which are, they have a lifetime warranty and are pretty amazing. Um, and as you all know, when you cook probies, you need to take them out when they boil and lift to the top. And we have this thing, it's called a scoop and drain. And instead of having to pick up the whole pot, dump it into a thing, because it's, you know, it's rather heavy. Um, I've just got this uh, scoop and drain. I've got a bowl over here, because um, then my next step is I've, uh, I've air fried some bacon in my air fryer, and then I'm going to uh, do it, uh, fry it up with some onions and bacon, and then I've got some sausage in there. So we're having sort of a Ukrainian <laughs> meal tonight, I guess you might say. But yeah, the scoop and drain is great, because, you know, instead of getting, like I said, the whole big pot up of hot water, it's uh, easier just to scoop it in. You can use it also with pasta as well. So I, I find when I'm making like ravioli or tortellini, um, it's great for like, you know, that smaller pasta. Um, I don't really use it for like spaghetti for obvious reasons, but um, yeah. Anyways, just wanted to pop in um, and uh, let you know about that little gadget here and uh, about our uh, nonstick hot. Uh, pots and pans, which are great. I don't have any pans out right now, but uh, maybe I'll pop on when I'm doing my uh, frying my uh, onions and bacon. Okay, see you soon. Um, so just before I get all the ingredients ready to put in my nonstick pan, I just thought I would show you the, um, the, the handles that come off. So great for storage, you take the handles off and uh, they store better. You don't have to worry about them getting in the way when you're trying to stack your pots. So I'm just gonna turn this around so you can see it here so there's a little little edge here and there's a little button and you push the button and you slide it back and you just can get it right into the pan and the same way to take it off you push the button slide it back and it comes off so super easy um, so if you want to say put your pan in the oven and like broil something like sometimes what I do is I'll make a frittata or an omelet I'll flip it over put it in the oven melt some cheese on it perfect so yeah just wanted to show you how easy to get it is on and off and again, like these non-stick pans are um, truly non-stick, lifetime warranty uh, on the pan itself. It was only three years, but they're great. Um, nothing sticks to them at all. And yeah, nice thick uh, titanium steel. So, all right, I'm gonna go get my stuff ready to fry up the probies. So um, I'm here now with the uh, onions I chopped up using the food chopper. Uh, and I just put them in butter, just more for flavor, but you really do not need them at all uh, for this pan. Uh, nothing sticks to it when I put it, it's great. Um, so yeah, just to show you that, I'm just gonna, I did cut up some bacon that I cooked in the air fryer, so I'm gonna mix that in with uh, the onions, cause you know, nothing's better than onions and bacon. I didn't put too many onions in, just one shallot because my oldest is uh, not a big fan of onions. <laughs> Anyways, I guess I chopped my head off there. So yeah, so I'm just gonna put all those in, bacon, and then I'm just gonna put the probies in. Okay, so that will be our delicious dinner for this evening, um, along with some sausage that I have uh, in the uh, slow cooker right now. So yeah, here we go. They did a good job of keeping the progies from sticking together, but uh, they won't stick to the pan once they get it in here. But um, anyways, yeah, we'll just fry those up and uh, serve it with some sausage that I put in the air fryer. I can give you a snapshot of that. I think it's all done now. And um, that will be our, uh, our, uh, our dinner for this evening. And uh, apparently I have a howling dog in the background. My, uh, my, my kid is obsessed with puppies and kitties, if anyone, if you know her. Okay, I'll show you the uh, finished dinner later. Enjoy your evening, everyone. Look at it sizzling away, my pierogies. Brown them up with the onions. Here is the sausage that I made along with it in my air fryer. So they're nice and toasted, or not toasted, I guess. I guess they're fried. Anyways, that will, that, uh, will be accompanying my pierogies.